Hey, Calfsters. Welcome to my uh, office for Calf's Cribs. I wanted to give you a tour of my space here. The one thing I wanted when Elizabeth and I bought a new house was to have an office full of art. And I'm going to give you a little tour of it now. So we're going to start with the smaller stuff up here. Um, that's a Josh Cassara Wolverine. And that is Richard Pace Magic. Another Josh Cassara Colossus. One great thing about Josh is that he does a head sketch whenever he sells you a piece of art. So I have a bunch of these. There's a Magneto, as you can see. Thank you letter to me. Another Josh Cassara Jean Grey. Then we got a nice Ken Lashley Cyclops. Moving along, this is a recent pickup. This is a Chris Pachalo Gen X piece. Simon Bisley uh, Man Thing. Chris Pachalo Wolverine and Spider-Man. Larry Strowman, uh, Ghost Rider. Jim Lee, Hulk and Sasquatch. That's by an Australian artist, Will Plyden, is the Phoenix there. Not sure if everyone knows, but this is uh, Adi Granoff's sister, Dejana Granoff, doing the Jean Grey there. How could I not have my original X-Men 1 signed by Lee? Claremont and Scott Williams back in the 90s. Finally, something published by Josh Cassara, his first X-Force cover. And a Josh Cassara Beast sketch. One of my favorite pieces, uh, Adam Kubert Wolverine. It's actually the first Feral Wolverine DPS from issue 75. John Byrne. Recreation of a DPS from X-Men uh, 113, I believe. Buzz Sawyer strip. Oh, sorry. We got Thor by Mignola. And then a Buzz Sawyer strip. I need another strip to fit in there. Moving along. Declan Shelby, Punisher. Uh, Paul Smith print and a Ron Wilson. Oh, Ron Wilson recreation of a thing cover. <laughs> Ron Garney, Uncanny X-Men DPS Wolverine coming at you Nice Jeff Isherwood Thor DPS Rafa Sandoval doing Magneto One of my favorite Adam Kubert covers for Weapon X-10 Wolverine and all of his women an Uncanny X-Men cover by Declan Shalvey. Page from Wolverine Black, White, and Blood by Josh Cassara. Those reds are all hand-painted by Josh. Scott Williams Uncanny cover. David Finch New Mutants cover. Uh, Frank Cho, Blue Line, with Aranga Inks of Savage Land Rogue. Then we got the Hugo Smith Corner. We got uh, Phoenix, Goblin Queen, Rogue, and the Inhumans. And Aranga Phoenix Silhouette. An Adam Kubert DPS from uh, Age of Apocalypse. A much more recent Adam Kubert DPS. This is actually a model print with a sketch. Alan Davis, the Excalibur 50 cover. Art Adams, X Men Years of Future Past or something to that effect cover. Goblin Queen by Declan Shalvey. Boba Fett by Mark Laming. Joe Jusco, Beast Card Art. Sabretooth cover by Dustin Weaver with a overlay done by Mikhail. Thank you, Mikhail. John Byrne from Iron Fist 15. Old Wolverine and Iron Fist battling it out. Alan Davis and Paul Neary from Excalibur 2. Warner Roth, X-Men, twice up, end page. 
The King, Jack Kirby, X-Men page from issue 10. Jim Lee, Scott Williams from X-Men 2. John Romita Jr. from X-Men 202. Another Buzz Sawyer strip. Another strip. Carlos Pacheco from uh, Uncanny 1. Recent edition, I'm really happy to have it. Jim Lee Splash from Uncanny 275 with Scott Williams Inks. Todd McFarlane, the only DC piece you'll find around here. Infinity Inc. Steve McNevin, Wolverine uh, from Wizard. This is an Adam Hughes piece that was from the 80th anniversary of Captain America. Re Doing the Caps meeting with the Avengers when he's unfrozen. David Mack, Psylocke. Eric Kennedy, re imaging the uh, classic Sinkevich Dark Phoenix cover. And a Larry Stroman Phoenix, like you'll never see again. That's it, Kath. Thank you very much. Hope you enjoyed.